everyone, it's Dana and welcome back to my channel. I have a Dollarama haul and a Dollar Tree haul. I'm just gonna mishmash them all together. Um, I had to go out and run, I had to go get a new phone today and I am delighted to say that I'm still working off my old phone because it has turned into an iPod. Um, because it's still connected to the Wi-Fi, I can still upload videos and I understand this phone. So we're going to work off the old phone. So um, I legit went to seven dollar Amos today, guys. Seven. I only purchased items at two out of the seven. Uh, five out of the seven, I didn't buy anything, walked out without anything. And naturally, it was my first two that I snooped a little bit. I was looking for the faux croc slippers that I found. I was looking for some for my mom. She really liked mine and she just will not take these ones. I've tried to give them to her and she won't. So I ran around today to seven Dollaramas trying to find them for her. And I think I just lucked out with the ones I found. I think I'm too late in the season um, for slippers because summer aqua, aqua socks, I can get you. 50 pairs because that's all starting to roll out the summer stuff so anyway and I was looking for the treasures paper pad and I didn't find it I was looking also too for the um Martha Stewart little envelopes didn't find those so anyway I do I did find some things so I will show you what I got first off I got these stickers and they were 50 cents so I picked up two packages of those one for me and one to gift and then I picked up this package of stickers. I already owned these, but I gifted them to somebody. So it's a repurchase and they were a dollar. I found another style of the Hallmark magnet and it's this one. And it says smiles fit your style and then the little camera and then deco. And these were a dollar fifty. So I guess there's three styles of those Hallmark magnets out there. I picked up a package of this instant tack for a dollar. Um, in my bedroom, I have frames around my um, outlets, the sockets, and a frame around the light switch plate. And rather than use the blue, I use the white so that I don't, it's probably going to mark up my wall over time, but I'd rather it mark it up in white than blue. So um, just for reference, guys, just the little two outlet socket it's a three and a half by five picture frame from the Dollar Tree and then I have a, a three um, light switch plate I think it's a four by six I don't know but if you've got a four by six frame hanging around in a five by seven try them around your outlet but certainly the little two socket deals you know um, is a three and a half by five picture frame that goes right around the outside just to jazz them up. So I picked that up. I found some purple markers. So I got those for my planner. I got, I'm trying to just put all the Easter off to one side. I got these cute scented pens and they're just tiny wee for pocket letters and they were $1.25 for five. I got these cute little, they're, they were in the hair section and they're just little fur balls. I got them for my planner and it's just on an alligator clip. But they also at the back have a, like for a pin if you want to wear it as a pin. But I got it for my planner and they were $1.25. I got this picture frame. It, it's just glass and it was $3.00. I brought home, the last time I was home visiting my family, I got a picture at a bazaar in Belfast. And I really don't want to spend $100 to go and get this mat framed, even with a coupon at Michael's. I, I just don't want to spend the money. And foolishly, I could have bought it framed or I could have bought, uh, well, hang on, I'll show it to you. Okay, so here it is. It's just a, it's just a picture of some pubs in... Um, Ireland I had a really really good afternoon in this one here the crown bar um, yeah so it's been I don't want to spend a million dollars to go and frame this thing that cost me five pounds at the market foolishly I could have spent ten pounds and bought the framed one but I, I didn't I was trying to save five pounds you know so but at the end of the day it has caused me no end of grief because it just sits there on my, my little ladder over here and it falls down when I have the windows open so it's little corners are all bent and banged up and anyway 
I thought that perhaps this might be the ticket. It's just taped on the back, see? So I thought maybe I can take it off of the matting and put it in here. I don't know if that's the answer, but it's a better answer than just this flopping around all over the place. So there you go. Hopefully the Belfast pubs will be up somewhere. Um, I got some bacon at the Dollarama, don't you know? So the Ready Crisp Bacon was there um, for $2 a package, and the best before date is July 7th of 2018. So I bought two packages of that so that I could have a sneaky toast and bacon sandwich. Uh, yeah, okay. Uh, Jane, close your eyes and plug your ears for the next 20 seconds. All right, so I picked this up for my my stepmother for Mother's Day. It's just a package of hand lotion. It was $3, and the scents are lavender passion, pink grapefruit, and argan and shea. And then I got this sweet little gift box with the little teacup on there and the glittery flowers. It was $1.25, just so I can put something in there for her, just as packaging, really pretty packaging. Okay, Jane, it's okay. You're okay. Um, okay, now we are down to just Easter. I got these cute little chalkboard Easter bunny clothespins. There's only three here for $1.25. It also came in an egg, but I thought this was cute. So I grabbed that. I got this little package of eggs. And there's six of them in here, and they've got little flowers painted on them. And these were $1.25. I got this Lonely Little Soldier package of washi. It's the only one I found in seven stores, so I'm pretty sure it's last year's washi, but that's okay. So the thing is upside down, so here's what it looks like. So here. I got that. I got this guy. Look at how cute he is. So I thought he was pink, and the lady at the cash go, oh, it's a really pretty purple. So... It's whatever color you want it to be. I want it to be pink, so it's pink. Um, so this little guy was $2. There was also a silver bunny, a green bunny, and a blue bunny in this chrome finish. Um, I didn't like the design of them, so I just got this sweet little sole. And then lastly, I just picked up two packages of organza bags, one in the pink and one in the purple, and it's a three-pack for $1.25. Um, no, not lastly, I've got one more item. Um, I have in the past picked up that little, um, Ziploc container of bags, seasonal bags, but I always end up with a bajillion left over that I have to store. So I thought, you know what, I'm just going to start off with six little bags and see how I get on if I need more. I know where to go. And then lastly, this is true. Lastly, Dollarama, I picked up this package of Wilton bags and there's 20 in here for $1.25. It's not seasonal so I can use it whenever I want. All right, so that's Dollarama. So I'm gonna pause you guys, clear out and then move Dollar, Dollar Tree in, hang on. Okay, so now we have Dollar Tree. It truly is tiny, tiny. I ran in, zipped around, ran out. Um, I'm having more fun at the Dollarama these days, I have to be honest with you. In the crafting department, like they're just, blowing the DT out of the water for the moment and I'm hoping that changes because I love the DT so much and I'd rather spend a dollar 25 for everything than this was three dollars this was a dollar 75 this was 50 cents just don't make me think so hopefully the DT is going to start coming around a little bit so I have not been spending much time there so just have a few small things first things first I got these three packages of Rick Rack so the white the red and the pink for $1.25, and there is nothing written on here. Four yards on each one, and it is by Multicraft. So I got that. I got two more packages of the felt die cut stickers. I got the butterflies, and I got the birds. They had the seahorses, and they had fish. I guess those are the, and the owls. They had owls, I didn't get those, so I just got those. I got a pack of a loaf of really good, nice vegan bread that I like, and it is the Stone Mill Slow Crafted, and it's sprouted grain bread. I really like this vegan bread, um, so I'll just throw it. I, the bread guy was there when I was there. I'm like, do you have any of that really good vegan bread? He's like, yeah, yeah, I got some. So I picked up one. They also had 
um, in the vegan loaves a rye and um, 12 grain, I think it was, but I just picked this one up and I just, it just lives in my freezer and I get it out. It's very bad to put bacon on a slice of vegan bread. Like you, I, Somebody's going to strike me down one day, but anyway, that's what I do. Um, yeah, and then I found this cute little keychain. Look, it's blue with some sunglasses. They had all kinds. They had a little pink one, and she had eyes with eyelashes. And anyway, and then lastly, I broke down and finally bought the little elephant bank. I keep looking at it, and I've got the saving for a rainy day, or I'm no quitter buying some shoes bank from the Dollar Tree. But in terms of decor, I think this guy's sweet. I had a hard time making a decision between him and the hedgehog with the little crown because I think that little hedgehog is sweet with its little dots all around it. But at the end of the day, I ended up getting the elephant. So yeah, so that, that's it for the Dollar Tree. What? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight things. Mm -hmm. Eight things at the Dollar Tree. I'm telling you, it... I tried to buy other things, but there wasn't anything there for me to buy. So I think too, a little bit, I was burnt out from all of my Dollarama extravaganza. Sorry, my hair's driving me crazy. And I had to go um, to Virgin and get a new phone. And I am delighted to say that I'm still using my old phone because it now has turned into an iPod. So it's still connected to the Wi-Fi, and I can still record my videos and upload them and so nothing's really changed. I don't have to learn. I have a new device that I've got to figure out how to phone off of and text. But for the moment, I can still continue to use this one for my little video. So I'm happy about that. All right, everybody. I hope you enjoyed that. And I hope you have better luck than I did out there at the Dollar Dollarama. Figure it out. In Barhaven, I need the Treasures Paper Pad and Croc Slippers for adults. So yeah. All right, guys, that's it. Have a wonderful day. Talk to y'all soon. Bye.